So Skur Ritual had a roadmap launch. Like they they have a roadmap behind me here, and we're gonna be talking about uh, basically what to expect in the future, which is really nice actually. If uh, we want to take a quick look here in the coming months, we have content drops, we have quality of life changes, and we have bug fixes. Uh, starting with uh, new DLC. We're getting new cosmetic DLC. Uh, it's going to be based off of the community suggestions. So if you're over on the Skur Ritual Discord, you can have your voice heard, give input on what future cosmetics you want to see for Skur Ritual that you would love to pay for. I am excited to kind of see what they cook up over there. In May, we are getting crossplay for PS5. We are getting a bevy of quality of life improvements, including ADS sensitivity, trigger remapping, weapon, FOV slider, and a PS5 120 field of view, uh, as well as some major console optimization. In June, we are getting a new standard weapon set. In July, we are getting our first major content post-launch with a new map, House of the Damned. We are getting a new map. We are getting a new special weapon. We are getting new perks. We're getting a new hardcore Easter egg, and we're getting a new Easter egg music track. I'm kind of hoping that the new perks can be interchangeable with the base map. Basically, you can choose which of the five uh, when they correspond with the colors. You know, like the sprint one is green and the lightning one is purple. I I'm kind of hoping that we can like switch them in and out, but I highly doubt that that's going to happen. I'm a little optimistic though i would be excited if they did something like that but it, it's most likely perks associated exclusively with house of the damned in august they're going to do a little bit more cleanup especially post launch for the house of the damned map as well in september we are getting a new standard weapon set again and then in october we are getting a second content drop tides of terror with the new map we're getting a new special weapon new perks new hardcore easter egg and easter egg music track again i'm pretty sure that the perks are going to be exclusive to tides of terror but one can only dream uh they also have ongoing post-launch roadmap they just want to be sure that the game is running smoothly that the balancing is fine network is okay between all of uh pc and xbox and playstation um they are always looking for feedback so make sure that you are giving input to the status of the game if something doesn't feel right if there is an issue with the game make sure that your voice is heard over at the skur ritual discord the the developers of skur ritual it feels like they are really running with the ball here i i think that we desperately needed a game that kind of scratched the Call of Duty Zombies itch uh, outside of Call of Duty Zombies. I think Call of Duty Zombies has kind of gone away from what made it fun and popular to begin with. And Skur Ritual is a great alternative. It's only $20. And with all of this extra content coming in uh, 2024, I highly suggest either keeping an eye out for any sort of sales or purchasing the game for $20. I uh, Again, like this game is awesome, and I've been having a lot of fun. And uh, if you like what you see, uh, let me know in the comments down below if you think that there should be something extra. Are you surprised that there are any sort of supports happening for the post-launch as well? Let me know in the comments. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Catch you on the flip-flop.